Welcome to our R Markdown tutorial. Today, we're tackling a specific question that many users encounter when working with dynamic documents. Our viewer wants to know how to hide an entire page in an R Markdown document based on a parameter condition. Specifically, if the parameter P is not equal to A, they want to exclude page two from the final output. Can this be done? Let's find out. Welcome back to another technical video. Today, we'll be going through your question, answers, and hopefully finding that solution that you're looking for. Guys, remember to stay just a little bit crazy, just like me, and hopefully get through to that resolution. Now, let's continue on. To hide an entire page in an R Markdown document based on a parameter, we can use conditional statements. Let's start by reviewing the document structure. Next, we will introduce a conditional statement to check the value of parameter P. If P is not equal to A, we will skip the content for page two. Now, let's apply this logic to the content of page two. We will wrap the content of page two in an if statement to control its visibility. Finally, ensure that the rest of the document remains unchanged. This way, if P is not A, only pages 1, 3, and 4 will be generated. Let's now look at a user-suggested answer. To hide entire pages in an R Markdown document, you can use a simple trick. Surround the section you want to hide with the commands ifalse and fi. This method requires that the R code inside remains valid, as it will be processed by knitter but ignored by LaTeX. Here's how it works. If the parameter P is not equal to A, the section will be hidden. Make sure to include the necessary R code to manage the visibility. And that's it guys. We've gone through, found the solutions, and hopefully answered your query. If it did, please hit subscribe. I really appreciate it. And until next time, hope you have a good one. Cheers.